Looking good, guys. Check this one out. It's going to be awesome. Wow. Freedom Records. 2011 to infinity. We're going in. So the last Tulsa mayoral election had, for the first time, an independent candidate who claimed 19% of the voting. When I heard that D-Rob was coming in as an independent on the next mayoral election, I was like, OMG, let's get this. So here we are downtown. It, uh, it's time for the next uh, blog entry. So I figured I'd talk a little bit about the week. Sponsors for the bash are coming together. Work has been extremely active, putting together conversion funnels, tracking uh, inquiries, conversions, and turning all that into money somehow. We've also begun to push the WOW record pretty heavy. It's in uh, rotation here on a couple radio stations here in the state. So we're kind of hoping to get a lot of really good wind out of that. Dangerous Rob's putting it down. We've been working hard putting the video together now, trying to find some downtown locations. Tonight is the night of Sugar Rum Cherry, which is burlesque ballet, folks. All right, we are going to talk about tonight's escapade. And uh, as you all know, I'm Trevor Lane. And tonight is the night of sugar rum cherry. What? 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 And, and I, I want to get uh, Erica's rendition of Mr. Wesley Winston, who will be <laughs> gracing us tonight. Wes And he's not new to this video stuff. No, he's real good with it. <laughs> Taking video of himself. Amber, what do you have to say to the world? What's up? You have really good style. I like sometimes on Facebook, I'll be clicking through and I'm like, you, I won't, like, I know who you are, but I'll see some girl in like an outfit, you know, something sling. I'm like, who is that? And I realize it's you and I'm impressed. I don't know, take that however you will. Thank you. Two, of, uh, <laughs> two thirds of the House of Infamy. Two thirds. That's 66%. 66.66. If you keep going, You'll hit sextillion, then infinity after that, because it's a number that just keeps going when you divide 100 by 3. And metrics, as uh, Wesley Winston will tell you, are a very crucial piece of success. Well, you have to track your campaigns to know whether or not they're successful. You have to know that you're spending your money intelligently. I mean, come on, let's get honest here. Honesty is a, is a cute thing in this world. This is how we do in T-Town. The thug, baby. Hey, last night uh, it was a rather progressive event that uh, a lot of people understood. Other people didn't get, and um, the 
interesting to see what happens with next year. Um, the way people in middle America operate is infinitely different than what I'm used to on the east and the west board in terms of advertising, marketing, promotions, sponsorships, collaboration, diplomacy. But uh, that having been said, it has been an interesting uh, work week and uh, looking forward to seeing the segments of this video blog come together. So here we are, the end of the work week and the weekend is here, quickly arriving. Got to go to Oklahoma City, take care of a few last minute things. Uh, matters in the office have gone well this week. Things with talent have been interesting. One more thing, happy holidays. Get your shopping done. Uh, I'm stuck here at the office today. Talon apparently uh, just called me and told me that uh, he told Santa Claus what he wants for Christmas. And um, I'm sitting here checking out this new, uh, a different Christmas poem revised. You need to check that out. It's on YouTube. It's called A Different Christmas Poem Revised. And uh, it's kind of interesting. Well, after I'll be good, man. Very long week and uh, finally getting home from Oklahoma City. Um, really the only words of advice I have for folks is, you know, if you're challenged with dealing with people, um, be honest, be direct, be upfront, keep it real. Hiding behind employees and putting out other folks to do your dirty work and stuff like that, it's just a matter of time until it catches up with you. Um, I hope this doesn't offend anybody that's uh, reading this, just needed to vent, get that off my chest because those of you that do that, that have dealt with me or my friends here lately, you know who you are. Just be real, just be honest, drop the smoke screens, stand up, be a man, be a woman, and take care of business, man. Don't hide behind other people or hire them to do your dirty work when it's simply yes.